but when I was sitting on the inner tube going under those waterfalls, I was freezing. I had to jump right back into the water. <sighs> <sighs> What's going on everybody? My name is Mario. This is a channel all about amusement park type stuff, but mostly coasters. Today is gonna be a fun hodgepodge of different universal stuff because my buddy Drew and my buddy Cliff are visiting me in Orlando. It's gonna be a fun time. I'm heading to the airport to pick them up right now. And then we're gonna go to Volcano Bay in this lovely uh, 50 something degree weather. That'll be exciting. Okay, bye. Picked up the picked up the boy some uh, matching flip flops for our day at the day at the bay, baby. Cliff, how are the flip flops? Terrible. Yeah, they're like rock hard. <laughs> the thongy parts like smash up your toesy woesies. Don't and... ever buy me anything ever again. <laughs> Dude, what did you think of the flip flops? Uh, they kind of suck. They need to see the flip flops in action. Though, you, should, you should give me five stars on Wikipedia, please. Those aren't five stars. Though. It's looking stylish. You got the SpongeBob's? Are you wearing the SpongeBob's? Oh, it's yeah. actually bearable with the socks. It's on. actually a decent. It's socks not on. miserable. Yeah. I don't have socks. Here, have one of mine. <laughs> I should have held this with my left hand because my right hand is more adept to doing things. There we go. Don't patronize the river. So this isn't necessarily the most convenient park to vlog at. We had all of our stuff in the lockers. But yeah, it's been it's been a chill time and also a very exciting time. It is so dead that everything is a right now, including Krankatau, their uh, water coaster. Which, Cliff, what did you think about that? That's... Uh, that, if that had to rank amongst some of my coasters, um, that would be uh, like top 50 worthy right there. Airtime without a restraint. It, it doesn't get any better than that. We did the uh, trap door slide, right? What did you think about that one? Uh, that was my first trap door slide. Um, I was getting butterflies the whole way down. It didn't hurt. Yeah, that was a nice thing about, I don't know the names of the uh, trap door slides, but the one Kukori. It's just straight down, no turns, no nothing. Incredibly smooth, a little like bumpy on the water when you get to the bottom. But uh, if you don't typically like body slides, I don't think you have a problem with that. Uh, however, the body slides that are twisty and stuff, the, you can feel every connection. And uh, the guys were telling me my back is pretty scratched up. So if you're looking for a really intense, intimidating experience, but don't want to get your back scraped up, definitely do the one that just goes like straight down. All right, we're in, um... Drew, what's it called? I know it's called the Fearless River, but what's the real I name? forget the first part of the game. This is the best part, honestly. I like this part the best. This is where it feels like you're drowning the most. Yeah. True. Who needs a GoPro 360 when you can do this? Oh. Um. Bye. Bye. Anyway, Drew sucks. Am I right? <laughs> yeah. It's 
Hey, Joe, I was just talking to Cliff about how cool you are. <laughs> Yeah, that's the best thing ever. That's so much fun. Oh, this is what you haven't gotten to see in the vlogs. Every single time we come out of the water, it's just this. It's just misery. Kiora, my nipples are freezing. <laughs> now it's lunchtime. I got the pulled pork sandwich. Comes with a side of fries. It's like 13 bucks. Not terrible value. I've been munching on these fries for like five minutes already. They're pretty darn good. Really tasty. But after lunch, we're gonna go around the park and try and film as much as we can. It's hard to show how good this park actually is, especially on a day where there's nobody here. It's so relaxing, but also the slides are exciting. It's just such a good time. Sure had a tasty drink, yeah? He's, yeah, in, a, he's, he's in the mood right now. I'm fine. <laughs> it's, 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 I'm fine. <laughs> you can tell it's not exactly uh, water park weather by the fact that they're both wearing jackets right now. Yeah, I know it is. It is yes. pretty cold. Anyway, this is the water coaster. This drop right here, it's the last drop of the ride. Are people coming down it? I hear he screams. Oh. That thing is insane. You fly out of your seat no matter where you're sitting. It's a really long ride. It winds all in the volcano and all that. If you guys have never experienced a water coaster before, what it does is it actually propels you upward, either using like uh, water jets or magnets. This one's magnets, so it's super smooth. It pulls you up that lift hill, and then you just turn around, do some drops, and it just repeats that like four or five times, six times maybe even, maybe even seven times, who knows? And this is the other trap door slide that I did earlier, the one that scratched up my back. We had to walk all the way up those stairs. 209 stairs, I believe is what it says. It is high up. Right now we're on a bridge standing above the Fearless River. This thing's super fun. It, it feels like you're getting uh, swept away and you're never gonna see your family ever again. Really fun. It's super fast paced compared to the other river. It also has waves similar to a wave pool that go through the river and uh, they even make you wear a life jacket. You can't go in the river without a life jacket. So that gives you an idea of what the experience is like. Uh, but aside from it being super fast paced and crazy and fun, uh, you actually go under the entire volcano. Looking up in there is insane. You see actually that whole structure from down below and it's really awesome. These slides are kind of fun, kind of not. They are kind of scratchy backy. They oh dump no. you off to like, what? Oh no! Oh, yeah. <laughs> Uh, they drop you off at the end, which is kind of fun. Uh, capacity on them is pretty low because for the body slides, it's only one person at a time. So it just takes a little longer to get people through. But yeah, I mean, a little, little four foot or uh, six foot drop off at the end. And uh, yeah. so now I'm going to go through the one part of the volcano where I can't go up and get a good view of everything, but I can go through the volcano and look at some of the cool stuff in there. Oh my God, it is freezing right here. This is such a wind tunnel. There's so much wind blowing in. One of the cool things about this park is your Tapu Tapu, the thing that uh, reserve your spot in lines when there are actually lines at the park. Uh, it also activates cool interactive things around the park. So if I hit my Tapu Tapu there, it actually lets me control that uh, stream of water. And there's other cool stuff like I'll show you up over here. So 
So uh, we did a couple more laps on uh, all the S tier attractions here. Krakatau, still fists. That and the trap door slide. What's that one called again? The big boy trap door slide? Kokiri? Yeah, the kooky one. The river that goes super fast. That also fists. Um, I mean, just look at this place too. I mean, come on, come on, come on. But it, it was definitely fun to take a more leisurely day than when I was here with Javi, just like ride after ride after ride after ride, trying to get as much as in as we could before close. Like this is definitely like the best water park I've been to, but I think it even competes with other dry parks that I've been to as well. Even though I'm, I'm more partial to dry parks, I, I think I think this competes with dry parks. So yeah, Drew, after your first time to the park, what? Wow, Drew, which one's he? What's his name? So Cliff, after your first time, what did you think? Uh, that, um, as you, what do the kids call these days, uh, fists? Fists, I believe uh, that's yes, what the kids are yes. saying. Okay, yeah, the kids are saying fists these days, and I, I'm going to adopt that, adopt that term. Adopt the term. <laughs> um, yeah, so that is just exceptional and awesome and amazing, and it's like a second water park I've ever been to. Hi, hair. Um, Kiora hair. Kiora hair. Um, yeah, I want to experience this at night. I know, it'd be dope to be at this place at night, but... But yeah, I mean, two amazing water attractions that, like, could rival most, like, theme park, like, amusement park coaster attractions. Like, I'm all for it. It's good stuff. Uh, but uh, from the entrance of Volcano Bay, that's gonna do it. Um, make sure you check out Drew's channel and uh, Cliff's Instagram. You, you post a little bit now, right? I post a lot of it nowadays. Really? Yeah, I'm posting nothing but Polaroids and 35 millimeter photos. But thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't like the video, shut the up. No one wants to hear your opinions. Make sure to let me know what you thought in the comments below. Um, subscribe, obviously. And until next time...